every single digital touch point that you engage with has to be relevant, it has to be engaging, and it has to be personalized. And the challenge that that brings to the brand is really an existential crisis, uh, because if you are not doing it, your competitors are. Um, this is a sink or swim moment. It's, it's fight or flight for, for every brand out there. Um, because if you're not going to provide those really rich and deep and personalized experiences, your biggest competitor definitely is, and your consumer definitely expects it. Adobe Target today has four distinct capabilities that are powered by Adobe Sensei. Personalized recommendations, and this is something that we've had in market for quite some time, but it has evolved over time from being something that leverages the more simple collaborative filtering type of approach to something that really leverages machine learning to make decisions based on an individual's actions across their entire experience to determine the right set of recommendations, whether we're talking about products or videos or articles, that a particular visitor or user of an app should see at any given moment in time. Another feature that uh, we've had in the market for quite some time is something that basically automates the personalization of offers on a website or a mobile website or within an app. Every one of us as consumers, we visit websites and we often will see a particular offer or an on-site ad that's, that's showing up to us. And we go, all right, this is a good one for me. Now, what makes that decision about what offer should be shown? It could be completely random. It could be a carousel or it could be someone saying, I think that this is the offer that this particular segment should see. Or you could use machine learning. People can sometimes make the mistake of thinking a first time visitor that comes to a website or another digital channel is anonymous. Nobody that comes to a, a digital channel and interacts with it for the first time is anonymous. There's a tremendous amount of data available for us to begin the personalization process. Environment variables like geolocation, where are they coming from? What device type, operating system, connection speed. Um, refer variables, did they come off of a search? Did they come off of a display ad? We can begin to personalize that relationship, that communication at first touch. Uh, we're able to actually gather all of those interactions and treat it kind of like a conversation that the consumer is having with the brand. And Adobe Target can synthesize all of that information uh, and turn it into a relevant and personalized experience. So decisions that used to be made in a boardroom or a meeting room uh, can actually be made by, by the AI, uh, which means that the consumer is getting the exact right offer for them at any given point based on hundreds or thousands of data points that are unique to them and their customer profile. So the key value of automating your personalization initiatives is it really lets you extract maximum value out of the efforts that you're doing. Uh, a leading telecommunications provider actually recently ran an automated personalization activity uh, on a high traffic landing page. And this was a page that they'd already done A-B testing on and they were currently doing manual personalization. Uh, by switching to automated or machine learning based personalization, they were able to drive an additional 13% lift on top of the lift that they were already seeing through previous approaches. Our most recent addition to Adobe Target enables what we call one-click personalization, something that the market's been wanting for a long time. Uh, what we've done is really remove all the complexity around choosing an algorithm and understanding what you need to do with the data science uh, and distill all of that down into a single radio button click so that you can take any A-B test that you've ever executed uh, or have live right now and transfer it into uh, automated personalization or machine learning driven personalization with just one click. For years, uh, any optimization manager or someone that was doing A-B testing had to really watch that test very, very closely and pay attention to what was going on, almost babysit the test. And so what Auto Allocate does is leverages machine learning to really observe what's going on. And as something starts to appear to be a winning experience, it will say, all right, it's time to divert some of this traffic over to this winning experience so that we can be getting lift from that in real time. Recently, Forrester published a WAVE report focused on digital intelligence. One of the pieces of, of that was something that Forrester referred to as engagement optimization. Um, I really think of engagement optimization as another way of talking about personalization. And so the things that they are focused on included behavioral targeting, um, as well as recommendations and various types of testing technologies. And we're very pleased with the recognition that Adobe Target received in that category. We're now though at a, at a point where we know our customers need to start to really scale these efforts and that 
they can't do it with, with old approaches, old manual or rules-based approaches. Uh, what artificial intelligence lets us do is take that power of machine learning and data science uh, and apply those algorithms uh, and all of that intelligence uh, back to the consumer uh, so that the brand can deliver personalization at just massive scale.